just done with all of the surviving journalists risking their lives to open our eyes to the truth. And we must stand against our own government officials, our corrupt media outlets, and our corporations who try to lie to us and convince us to look away. We will not look away. We will never take our eyes off Palestine. We will not be silent or silenced. Bearing witness to this ongoing ruthless assault and the scale of the suffering that it is causing can make us feel hopeless and helpless. It can make us feel alone in our anger in our, and our grief. But we are not alone and we are certainly not helpless. Not if we organize, not if we continue to support and amplify each other, to build strong networks, to combine our voices and our resources to work for change. Not if we come in, keep coming together like we are today to mourn the dead and fight like hell for the living. Organized movements work, boycotts work. There is a precedent for the success of targeted, meaningful action. Starbucks has reportedly lost 11 billion in its market value and has been kicked out of Morocco. Puma, after years of sustained campaigning, was forced to end its sponsorship of the IFA. Fisher German finally cut ties with Elbit Systems as a direct result of the sustained and strategic efforts of Palestine Action. These are significant victories, but to enact real change, we also need to look closer to home.